Well, hello everyone. It's me, Daniel, with Website Candy, and I don't know if any of you guys watched it. However, I definitely tuned in in regards to the WWDC 2016 today from Apple, and the event was really awesome. It was really great. It was really cool. Uh, once again, Apple is doing what they normally do. They are the app killer. They actually make other things obsolete and they bring it into the devices that we're using on a day-to-day -day basis. And they're just making it work really, really well. Um, I have an application I want to show you guys. It has some pros. It has some cons. And I want to show you, um, you know, what I like about it and what I dislike about it however right here this section I want to focus on where it talks about you know auto unlock your Mac with your watch okay now this is a really cool feature right here there's an application right here I've been using for over a year it's called Mac ID and it's really really cool it's really really neat and um, one cool thing about it right out the box like I mentioned I want to say all the pros and cons about it but as I come up here to my little icon for Mac ID the one is indicating that I have one device connected I can connect my iPad but I don't really see it as necessary so um, I can connect the watch but I don't see the watch as necessary I had it connected before for a little while however you know I disconnected it I really wasn't using it on the watch that much but right here like I mentioned uh, tap to unlock and you can create yourself a pattern and I've created a pattern for myself I'm not going to do the pattern in front of you because I don't want you to know my pattern password if you was to ever get close to my computer however you know I do want to show you the app on the app store here which is right here and uh, right here on my phone you can see the application now, I can't go all the way with it because one place that this application is failing is I just want to kind of you know lock it and show my screensaver and if that settings back here honestly I just really haven't allowed enough time or energy in regards to how to set that up however um, it does lock my computer and the thing I really like about it is with this application here I am able to you know walk away from my computer just like Apple displayed right over here on their keynote today and my computer locks uh, when I walk back up to the computer it will automatically unlock using this Mac ID it's free you can just come over here to the website and you can just download it is a hundred percent free and if we have some new Mac users out there that don't necessarily understand how to do it in full here's what you can do right here um, under security right here let me go ahead and authenticate real fast and you can see my phone jumped off right there so I created you know I'm gonna unlock my uh, computer right there and my phone actually popped up where I could just do the touch ID however right here uh, under the security and preferences like I mentioned um, security and privacy sorry uh, you can say anywhere allow app downloads from anywhere so when you go to download this application I have mine right here in the middle because I do kind of want that warning and I do want to accept it for sure however by default your Mac should be right here on the Mac App Store only so you know you have to actually come over here change this setting but there's also another way to do it usually when you download a um, Mac that's not if you go to download this right here and you don't have that setting that I just showed you there you can go over here to your applications and when you right click on the application for the first time when you hit open from here it will also give you the option to open it on the dialog box when it pops up I don't have a app to show you that's brand new right now but like I said I wish I could take you all the way through in regards to showing you how this thing locks but it's really neat I mean like I said you know there's all kind of different little uh, preferences in here uh, when I go back Back over here to the um, auto lock I can say you know the recommendation is the medium so when I walk away from my computer with my phone it automatically locks I can say higher for you know the closer I am to my Mac I can just go customize it and I can say you know within this range is right here and you can kind of test them and see you know how it works out but you know if you want to kind of get started with this locking and unlocking your Mac right away in regards to 
when you walk away from it and you walk up to it go ahead and download Mac ID it's free it's safe it's pretty neat it's pretty cool like I said I've been using it for over a year and one feature I extremely love about it like I mentioned and I'm not going to display it even if I try to I lock my screen here um, there is a sequence that I've created there's a tap sequence and through that tap sequence um, I'm able to unlock my Mac instead of typing in my password. So it's really neat. I mean, you just never know. Sometimes people might be looking over your shoulder. People might be, you know, just kind of, you know, watching your password, watching you type in your password. But when you do that sequence, sometimes when you do it with one hand, it happens so fast that they actually can't see it. I've actually done it right in front of people and showed them and demoed the application to people. And they was like, wait a minute, what did you just do? You know, and they're trying to watch my hands, but the hand moves quicker than the eye. But I will put this definitely, I would definitely, here's where you can see the tap sequence on your trackpad there, like I was mentioning. Um, here's the compatibility in regards to the, the Macs that you have to have um, in regards to the iMacs, the Mac Minis, things of that nature, and the different iPads and everything. And it's a, a really simple app. You know, you download on your phone, you download on your Mac, they work together. So, you know, if you guys were watching the, the Apple you know the um the apple keynote today wwdc 2016 you know here is something that you can kind of get started with right now because we won't be able to see this this is not going to happen until the fall in regards to we have to wait on this got apple got us all excited however we won't be able to get to use any of these different things until the fall so go ahead and get started today and let me know if it worked out for you if you need any help definitely reach out leave a comment and i'll be happy to help you make sure you like this video and if you haven't done yet subscribe all right thank you have a great day goodbye